Monday, April 2nd, 2012. This is the Todd Vlog. What's up, everybody? Hey, real quick video. No editing. No, no funny stuff. No videos of the family. Because it's Easter week, and you know worship leaders are super busy on Easter week. But, uh, yeah, I just I kind of missed vlogging for you guys. So, you know, I'm not... I'm not always nuts about the sort of turn on the, the laptop and just talk, but I uh, thought it would be cool to uh, share with you uh, some stuff I've been reading. thought that might be kind of fun for a vlog. I wanted to shoot a vlog and thought, well, that's what I'll do. I'll just kind of show some of the books I'm reading and uh, be interested if you're reading any of them or if you've got thoughts on them. Um, yeah, so anyway, uh, brand new, uh, I guess you could call it a book that I just got in. This is the Kingdom New Testament. This is the... New uh, Contemporary Translation uh, by N.T. Wright uh, of the New Testament. And as you can see, I'm not very far at all. Right there. That's as far as I've gotten. Um, Matthew chapter 2. But it's really good. Um, I really like N.T. Wright. I don't know if you've ever read him. Uh, but it's really cool. It is a contemporary translation of the New Testament. Um, and so far, has been really good. At least for two chapters. So that's one thing I'm reading. Uh, second thing I'm working on, just started on it. I know some of you have read this. Uh, Tim Keller with his wife, Kathy, The Meaning of Marriage. Uh, started this last week. Really like it. So Chris and I are going to read through this. I think I'm going to read it first. Uh, so far, really good. Love Tim Keller. Love him. Uh, and keeping with that same thing, boom, rereading through Tim Keller's Reason for God. I told you guys I had a plan, an idea of something I wanted to do with the vlog on this. I still want to do it. Um, I'm just not there yet. But um, so good. If you if you have questions about faith, maybe you doubt the Christian faith. Maybe you don't really know if the, 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 there's a God. You don't know if that's a real thing. It's a great book. Um, or if you just uh, want to participate in good, um, honest discussion about stuff like that, you can uh, read that book, and it's really, really good. And then this, got this about a month ago, and I love it. Um, it's called Face to Face. It is uh, based on... A book called Handbook to Prayer by this guy, Ken Boa. Um, uh, but it's this is the one, Volume 2, Praying the Scriptures for Spiritual Growth. And it's so cool because what he's done is, is he's taken scriptures and written them into personal prayers um, that you can just see that you just kind of read through and then pray. Um, I love it. It has been so good for me. Um, I, I, like a lot of people, struggle Making time for scripture, I just yeah, it's so easy to get distracted and get caught up in other things. And this book has been so good uh, to pray through the scriptures. I really, really dig it. So um, those are just some of the things that I'm reading, um, little by little. Uh, certainly not trying to read four books every day, uh, but just little by little, kind of working my way through those books. So yeah, I'm really interested to know if you've uh, if you've read those, but also. What are you reading? I thought you might could comment below something that you're reading that's uh, that's really good or or helpful. Yeah, so uh, thanks for watching and comment below.